Chair, let me just a bit touch on the latest remarks, especially what the minister is now responding to, pertaining to the legislative demands that are being uh, embarked on in order to change the status quo. One concern I have is that Minister, we, SABC has a minister for a reason, because it's a public entity. It's not newsroom. It's not ETV. It's SABC. Thus, a public mandate that it carries has to be, that mission has to be accomplished. So we cannot then, when we are looking for a business model of SABC and starting to compare it to private sector and wanting it to depict what private sector is, it will not be. It's a public entity and its business model has to be suitable to the needs of a public entity. That is why it is important, as and when we are getting people into the space of SABC, the first thing they have to appreciate is that this is not a business company that is looking for profits. This is a business company that must deliver a public mandate. And how we then draft and craft any policy within this space needs to fulfill that mandate. So I wanted to, Chair, highlight that. I'm not asking a question to anyone, but I want to highlight the fact that this, this is not in, like any other entity. So when Chair says it will have to come to a point of business, um, what do you call it? No, not business rescue. Um, coming to Parliament and asking for recapitalization or what. So if you have to be bailed out, you will be bailed out. But you will be bailed out on the basis of, are we satisfied with the internal capacity what the minister is talking to? Are we satisfied with the internal systems? Are we moving forward or are we moving backwards? But the mentality that this has to be shifted from being a public entity to a private operative machine is not going to work because it's not.